Hello, my name is Lewis and welcome to Gathering the Magic. And today is the day I'm finally getting the Prickly Marmoset tattoo. So for those of you that don't know the story of the Prickly Marmoset, let me just break it down quickly. So I started this channel at the start of the first lockdown and it was just because I bought a load of Ikoria boxes and one of my friends wanted me to open them boxes. Really been able to proper sort of dive in and get, oh, here he is, here he is, the boy. The boy. Uh, yeah. And somewhere along the way during the three videos, I uh, became in love with Prickly Marmoset. It was on the cover art of all of the packs. It kept suddenly appearing in every single pack. I had so many of them. And before I knew it, in every future video, there was just a Prickly Marmoset somewhere. We are at the point now where if you go over to our Instagram, we have many, many, probably over a hundred Prickly Marmoset memes. And we've got a whole community of people that absolutely love this ugly, ugly, little thing. So to fill people in, as we are nearly at 2,000 subscribers now, when we were at around about 800 or so, I think in July or June last year, I started putting up this picture here during videos. And I'd say, if we got 1,000 subscribers by August, then I would get a Prickly Marmoset tattoo. Now, obviously the main driving force of this was to boost the channel, try and get to 1,000 subscribers. But as someone that's heavily invested, making a couple of videos a week, really wanting to push this, I was always looking at our analytics on Social Blade, so I could see that, you know, it probably wasn't going to get to a thousand. There was a tiny little risk there, but I'd say there was probably a 20% chance of getting that prickly marmoset. So I felt very, very safe. And then of course, people like me, Master Steve, that does run our Instagram, other people were just pushing this out so much that it kind of really did catch wind. And then before August, I think maybe mid to end of July, we hit a thousand subscribers. So after a few weeks of mourning and slight regret, in August or maybe the start of September, I went over to Eternal Art Studio, which is one of the best, if not the best tattoo studio in, in rugby where I live. I even got, I don't know if you'll be able to see, but this was my first tattoo that uh, Spencer, who's doing my uh, tattoo today did. So I knew he was, the, he was the perfect man for the job because he is so ridiculously talented. So as I said, I went in September and I said, this, this is what I want, this legendary, this way well, it should be legendary, little monkey. And uh, I think I think they all, all kind of all kind of looked at me. What what is this thing? But because of COVID and a backlog, the soonest they could do was February the 9th, which is today. So now's the time. Gonna head on down. My appointment's at 10, it's now about quarter past nine, so time to head down there and get the tattoo. Oh, and one last thing, because of COVID regulations still, I wasn't allowed to have anyone in to help film. So I'm gonna try and get clips where I can. And then obviously at the end, if you haven't fast forwarded already, you will be seeing the prickly marmoset tattoo. Let's do this. And then I hopped in my car for what was literally a two minute drive, but honestly, it felt like the longest drive of my life. This was the point where I was easily the most nervous. And then we finally pulled up. I got inside and then we were sitting in the waiting room slash cafe area and I was here for about 10 minutes but again it felt like so long but when we sat down look at that marmoset that is perfection. There was also a Ben Stiller film playing for the first hour and a half and if you know what it is from this clip let me know in the comments below. After our first pause you can see here this was what the prickly marmoset was looking like and speaking of pause I'll pause it for just a sec so you can have a look at this because my one arm video recording skills are terrible. We then sat in the chair for another hour and I don't know why when I do these shots I always go from left to right. I must think I'm some right artsy idiot. So this next clip is from two hours in and we had to take another little break because I was bleeding quite a bit. And again, terrible camera work so I'll show you a nice little frozen image of my pain. And now it's probably time to see the finished result. Okay, so before we get into the final reveal of the Prickly Mouse Head Tattoo, I do want to quickly mention that I showed at the start of the video, we have a giveaway coming on our Instagram that starts tomorrow. And what we are giving away is one of the brand new Kamigawa Neon Dynasty Commander Precons. What do you have to do to win? Well, it's very simple. All you have to do is follow us on Insta, tag a few friends, and then we'll have a date and we'll pick a winner and we could send it to you. And the last little channel plug is we've just started a YouTube channel membership. Just for three pounds a month, you can help support the channel, get a nice little prickly marmoset badge. It's a win-win for everyone. But now it is time to move on to the tattoo. I think I'm gonna take my jumper off off camera so it looks like I'm 
not stripping, yeah. So, without further ado, the prickly marmoset tattoo. Hopefully I get close enough, but here it is. And let me just say, so it's been it's been eight days now. I've just allowed enough time for it to, to heal and it to not look so peely, because it has done. But yeah, I just absolutely love it. It's it's even it's even better than I ever thought. I'll post some pictures on now because I know my camera work hasn't been that great, but I've got some really nice shots that show how good it was. The tattoo itself, as you would have seen from a few of the clips, the first two hours, absolutely fine. Absolutely fine. I kind of almost enjoyed it. And um, yeah, that last hour, that last hour was horrible. It was, it was so painful. I think we stopped a few times because it kept, kept bleeding, but I absolutely love it. My mum, who is uh, not a tattoo fan, she loves it. How can you not love the prickly marmoset? Now, the big question is, what do we do for 2,000 subscribers? Let me know in the comments below and definitely, definitely don't make it anything tattoo related. Please, please, please. But as I said, I absolutely love it. I did think I was going to get it a bit smaller, but uh, Spencer the Tattoo has said that, you know, it would lose some of the detailing and it's just incredible. I'm already thinking of getting some getting some more stuff around here, maybe some maybe some mana symbols, I don't know. Again, if you've got any ideas for me, do let me know. And let me know what you think of it in the comments below. If you hate it, let me know. I don't care, because I love it. And lastly, I just want to thank everyone for the support on the channel. It's been amazing. There's been, there's been people for the last six months that have been asking a lot when the tattoo was coming, and I had to just keep saying, it's coming, it's coming. But no, I really, really love the support, and we've got so much planned for the near future. It's gonna be really, really cool. And hopefully, maybe even some Commander gameplay. And I think to leave everyone off here, I've gotta show the video that I found yesterday. It's the first box opening I ever did. And there's a really, really cool clip of the first time that I was ever introduced to the Prickly Marmoset. Can't think what that card's called, but it's, a, it's red, isn't it? Cute little boy. Okay, Jerob has really been able to proper sort of dive in and get, oh, here he is, here he is. The boy, the boy. Uh, yeah, there we have it. That is the Prickly Marmoset tattoo video. Thanks for watching and don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel for all things MTG. Check out our link tree in the description below for all of our social media and affiliate links. For now though, I'm all tapped out. So I'll see you in the next video.